Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I have something a little different. Um, today I have a mystery box. I searched Etsy and other places, but mostly Etsy because I love the whole like idea of handmade or coming from special little specialty shops um, for a mystery box for my birthday. I just turned 40 March 5th and I wanted to spoil myself a little. So after probably, I don't know, over a month or so of searching for what I really wanted to, to find, I found the Whimsy Barn Vintage. So she offers different styles of mystery boxes. She has Shabby Chic, um, Antique, uh, Farmhouse, which is the one I chose because we all know I'm a huge Joanna Gaines fan um, and French Country. So, you know, hence the blue. But anyways... Um, so I picked out this box. They come in all different sizes from extra small all the way up to large, I believe. And the prices determine the size you get, um, or the size determines the price it is. And it also determines how many items come in the box and the size of the items. She also has regular items for sale as well. So definitely check her out, guys. I'm excited to see. I waited all day while I was working, staring at this box like, oh, come on, I want to open this. Come on, work day. So super excited. So when I first popped it open, I didn't look at anything. I just saw this on top. Let me show you. <clears throat> I feel like I'm scrolling movie credits. So this says, thank you for your order from Whimsy Barn Vintage, Gathered Treasures of the Past. It says, looking for more vintage? Visit my Etsy shop at etsy.com forward slash shop forward slash Whimsy Barn Vintage. You can visit her on Facebook Marketplace for Sandy Johnson in West Dundee, Illinois. Or if you're looking for vintage t-shirts, you can go to Whimsy Barn Press on Etsy. And apparently she's got a vintage miniatures coming soon. You can also message her at whimsybarnvintage at gmail.com. So definitely check her out, guys. <clears throat> now let's get to the good part. So I have to be careful because of my arm, but... So this is the box. All I did was pop the top. Let me see if I can show you a quick sneak peek of how it arrived. I'm super excited. Look at this right on top. Okay, so let's move this. All right, so, ow. Just taking a little bit. Oh, they're all individually wrapped, guys. Look at this. All right, I'm super stoked. So because my arm's sore, I'm just gonna put this right here and we're gonna open one at a time, like so. So I believe I paid like $42 for this box and that included shipping, I wanna say. So very excited. What is this? All right, so this, look at this, is all sweetly wrapped to Samantha from Whimsy Barn. Oh my, I love this. I absolutely love this. All right, let's see what this is. It's like Christmas, guys. I'm trying to figure out how to open it. The wrapping, I gotta say, I'm absolutely in love with. So a great job there. This is like three pieces. What is this? All right, let's start with this. I don't know what this is. It's fabric of some sort. <gasps> Guys, look at this. It's like a tapestry or a dishcloth. Oh, this is stunning. So I told her I loved blues and French country and chickens and Joanna Gaines and Beiges. Look at this. They have like little, they what look like chickens or doves. Look at this pattern. This is absolutely beautiful and unique. I've never seen anything like this. And it could be a kitchen towel, a tapestry, anything. This is absolutely gorgeous. I am very happy with this. This is beautiful. Wow. I love this. All right. If that's the way this box is going to go, I'm super thrilled. I also told her I love like the burlap colors and the lace and everything from French Victorian times. So, what's this? Look at this! Oh, guys, look! These are little like tea towels or like um, napkins for your. Oh, these are going right with my um, my dinner plate set. They match my dinner plate sets beautifully. And it's a set of six. Oh, this is absolutely perfect. These are beautiful little napkins. Oh, look at that lace detail. Oh, okay. These are gorgeous. I am super happy. I gotta put this plastic over here. Hang on. Oh. Wow, look at this. 
it's just this beautiful vintage piece of lace in a beautiful color. It almost looks like it could have been like a collar or something. Oh, it smells vintage. I have an obsession for that. Look at this piece. I don't know what I'm gonna do with this yet, but I'm wondering if this would be really pretty hanging over one of my small little tables, just kicking over the side like that with a little planter on top. This is gorgeous. Absolutely beautiful. All right, so I am very happy with that. The next thing in the box, let's open this one because this is right on top. Look at how sweet these are wrapped. To Samantha from Whimsy Barn. Look at this. It's wrapped in beautiful, like the burlap looking paper. I love how she wraps everything. And it's very taken care of. Like she took the time and she put a lot of thought into the wrapping. But she did a beautiful job. I'm so thrilled. I don't want to drop this. <gasps> oh my God. All right. I love this woman. <laughs> this is so pretty, guys. I am in love. Oh, look at this adorable little picture. This is stunning. It is definitely pottery. I don't even care where it came from. It's just beyond gorgeous. <laughs> look at the detail in the handle. This is beautiful, absolutely beautiful. Oh, I am I am beyond floored right now. I'm like so happy. So again, this says to Samantha from Whimsy Barn. I wonder what her house is like. If she's got all these amazing treasures. <laughs> Let's see what this is. I did tell her I loved wood as well. And look at this unique bowl. It almost reminds me of, um, what do you call it? The thing that you grind. What is it? A pe pestle? Pe you know what I'm talking about? Like where you um, grind your spices and whatnot. Look at the knot in this wood. This is absolutely unique. I love this. I am so happy right now, guys. All right, what is this? Again, look at this. Look at how beautiful. She hand wrote, it looks like she hand wrote all of this. What, that's like such a special touch. I told her I liked milk glass. Look at this bowl. Oh, it's like she got in my head. <laughs> I am head over heels in love with this. Wow, this is beyond stunning. I love, love, love this. This is gorgeous. There hasn't been a single thing here that I don't like yet. This is insane. Guys, you need to order from her. <laughs> What a cool idea, right? This might be what everybody's getting for Christmas. It is what I thought it was. Look, see, a mortar and a pestle. Pestle, pestle? <laughs> That's what this is. Yes! I love these. Thank you. This is beautiful. <laughs> I knew I knew what that was. I was like, this looks familiar. What is this? Let's see. Oh, there's so much in this box, guys. Again, addressed. I love this wrapping paper, like, so much. This is heavy. <gasps> oh, look at this. Look at this vase. Look at this unique opening for, like, a single flower. I could totally put my single flowers from my garden in this. Just as I pick them, just one or two, plop it in there. Look at how beautiful this is. This is so unique, guys. Absolutely beautiful and very different. I love the opening. Actually, I think I have a fake flower somewhere. Hold on. Just to give you guys an idea, look at this. Look how pretty, right? It's a fake flower, but it will be garden flowers. This is gorgeous. Right, 
see if I can put all the wrapping paper over here. All right, here we go. Let's see. There's another one. There's three things inside this. This is so worth every dollar I spent, guys. This is insane. All right, let's open this. There was three little things in that big thing. It's blue. It's absolutely blue. It's Seltzer, Emerson Drug Company, Baltimore, Maryland. Look at this. It's like a cobalt blue. This is gorgeous. Oh, these are beautiful. Now, so I started collecting the tiny little like medicine bottles, the really unique ones and just different bottles because I think they're really pretty and they make such a statement with history behind them. Oh, look at it. Is this like a set? Look at this. It reminds me of a Robitussin bottle. These are gorgeous. Absolutely unique. Yep, it's a set. So this one is the seltzer as well from the Baltimore, Maryland. So it's a set of three. That is so cool. I think I'll probably use those for makeup brushes. I'll use them for something. I don't know. I'll, I love little jars and everything. This box is packed, guys. Let me take out the wrapping paper here. I can't believe this box. It just goes and goes and goes. Oh my, look at this. Yep, yep. I will definitely be ordering more from her. <laughs> this is such a cool experience. So this is by Handwrite Silver Look. It's got a little stamp on the bottom, which is really cool. I love this hammered look to it. Look at this gorgeous flower that was hammered into it. How absolutely beautiful and unique is this? I've never seen anything like this. This is stunning. This would be a beautiful piece on my dresser or on my kitchen table or even on like my end table with just like, you know, something. I mean, I could put, um, I could actually put the napkins on it. Well, no, because I want to see the flower. I'll figure, this is going to be displayed. This is gorgeous. And we've got this one. Oh, I'm so happy. What is this? What is that? Is this a cheese grater? Oh, it is. How awesome is this, guys? Look at this. It's a cheese grater. Oh, it totally is. It's sharp still. So, oh, look. It's got to be like this. You put it right here and you grind that is, it's like armor. It's like absolute armor for cheese grating. This is great. What a cool piece. All right. And the last thing in the box is this. Look at how cutely this is wrapped, guys. This is Samantha from Whimsy Barn. Oh, this is the best thing I've ever opened. This is amazing. Absolutely amazing. I love how she put this little nest and there's like a little little green leaves all over the pa tissue paper. How cool. And inside it looks like there are one and two little packages. This is the little nest that came in it and there's like, she put little tissue paper in the nest like so. Love this little nest. Let's open this little one. Best birthday present ever. All right, I'm gonna cry. I'll show you guys in just one minute, okay? Oh, okay. Awesome. This is so awesome. 
Okay, and it has three little eggs. Okay, now let me explain to you. Most of you probably know why I'm going to cry. But this is a mama hen with three little eggs. You all know the story and um, the trouble that I went through. Um, and I lost three little babies. And now I'm in fertility to become a mom um, with a donor embryo. So these three little eggs mean the absolute world to me. <laughs> um, and the fact that it's a mama hen and I love my chickens so much. Um, this is, I, I don't I don't even know, this gave me chills. This is absolutely perfect. I am so in love with this. Um, this has a lot of meaning behind it too to me. And uh, yeah, this is, this is beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. So look at this guys. <laughs> this is perfect. All right. So this is amazing. Um, I, I'm going to be ordering from her again. I want to try all her boxes now and I want to try like all the different types. Um, guys, Whimsy Barn Villa Vintage. Um, <clears throat> and I'll just tell you, I mean, she, she was wonderful to deal with. Her name's Sandy. She's wonderful to deal with. Um, these little treasures are beyond amazing. They're so cool. They're going to be in my house in all different areas of my house. Um, I can't wait to decorate with them and to put them places where they belong. Cause you know, they always have that place, you know, that you find that right spot for them. This was the best present ever. I am so grateful for this. Thank you so much. It was beautifully wrapped. It was beautifully delivered. Um, the items are in amazing shape. They are not junk, guys. These are beautiful antiques from the past. They have history behind them. They they just, they're amazing. Uh, they make you smile. So definitely check out her shop again at that Etsy. It is um, Whimsy Barn Vintage on Etsy. So go check them out, guys. I'll hold it up again for you. Whimsy Barn Vintage. I'm also going to link it down below so you guys can just click the link and click right on over to it. Um, but yeah, it was probably the best unboxing experience I've ever had. Um, it's so much fun and I kind of want to do it again. So she's probably going to hear from me again pretty soon. Um, this would also make a great gift for somebody, especially in quarantine, guys. For somebody to get this and have all these little cute, unique things to open inside that just make them smile. I mean, this would be a great quarantine gift. Um, something, you know, you miss somebody, go ahead and send them this little gift as a, you know, I miss you type gift or thinking about you. She does have all different price ranges. So it's very affordable. And this is the biggest one. And it was only like 42 bucks shipped roughly, I want to say. So check her out, guys. Um, once again, I can't begin to say enough about this. I, I don't even know. The, the items are great, but the wrapping and the unwrapping was so fun and so beautifully done that it just blew me away. So I totally give her a like 50 stars, whatever you can give them on Etsy. And I will go over there and leave one heck of a review. Um, her store is amazing. She's wonderful. Um, check her out, guys. I don't think you'll regret it. But thank you so much for joining me for uh, a new type of an unboxing. I'm hoping to do little ones like this every once in a while when I have a little extra that, you know, I want to spoil myself with because I've needed it. <laughs> but I mean, for real guys, like three, three, <laughs> this is pretty awesome. So I am going to jump off for now. Uh, like I said, check out that link down below. Also down below, there'll be a uh, link to um, get to my Facebook page if you want to learn about my journey and follow me on Monday nights when I make and sell jewelry to raise money for that donor embryo. Um, also, you'll find my address down there below. So if you have anything you want me to review on my channel or just to send me just for fun, feel free to drop it down to that address below. Other than that, guys, thank you for joining me. Don't forget to hit that like, share, and subscribe button at the bottom. Each click really does help me, um, and I'm super grateful for it. So thank you guys so much for joining me, and I hope to see you again in my next unboxing. Bye for now, guys. Check out Whimsy Barn Vintage. It's freaking awesome. <laughs> I'll talk to you soon. Bye.